Hey, hey, it's Wednesday, the 29th of March. The end of March is here. And for all of you who were the happy birthday wishes for my little daughter, I appreciate that. Thanks for that. Very much so. Uh, we had a great time last night. Wow. She and her friends were just super excited to be alive, let me tell you. Um, <clears throat> and we got everyone back safe and sound. Like that little place we went was like an hour away. And we've got all these little girls in our cars. We had two cars. So I'm glad we got it back safe and brought everyone's little precious cargoes back to them on time. Um, let's start out with PGV. There's a lot of news as far as announcements. He also put out another video uh, yesterday about 4.20 p.m. Uh, and that's, of course, after I left work. So I'll attach that onto the end of this. But let me read some of these things just to catch everybody up. All right, so Creator says, here's the wallet refunds will be sent from final wallets below. And it's the same ones that he sent out uh, a few weeks ago. Um, so I already have those uh, up and running here. So these are the three. So that one there, that one there, and that one there. Okay, so those are the three. We'll be looking for those once he gets them in, once he gets the money in. Okay, so he says, I will update everyone later tonight. I am talking to an advisor as to many people are trying to use everything I say and post against me. I have done nothing wrong to hurt anyone. Yes, there have been delays, but I am going out of my way to get everyone squared away through my own assets as collateral for a loan. I cannot control the time it takes for the loan to come through. I was approved on Saturday, as stated in a video. No matter what I do, everyone just wants to attack me and threaten me with legal filings. I really hope these people can wait until tomorrow when I start sending out refunds because this would really destroy and stop everyone from receiving them. I know there are so many people who need this to happen and I want it to happen for everyone. And that was at 6.18 p.m. Then at 7.21 p.m. He says, I was advised to not share any more sh screenshots. Everyone, please understand the collateral loan will be available tomorrow and I will start sending out refunds. I posted the three wallets they will be sent from, but I will post them again below with direct links. I am not going anywhere, everyone. I am going to get this done. Have some faith here. I want this loan to come in as soon as possible, just as everyone else does. These threats to me and my family it is not right, though. And then at 8.24, so he's pretty much every hour he's sending out some stuff. He says, please understand that I will be here until loans come in. If it comes in early, which I pray it does, I will start sending out refunds at that time. I am not giving up on anyone. I will post and update every few hours until the loan hits. All right, and today at 1.42 a.m., he says, Okay, for those of you who may have had a compromised wallet, you need to also fill out the refund form in the website. It has been updated to allow you to provide files. You need to provide quick video, please. That way we can make sure everyone is added to this sheet for remaining refunds. While I wait for funds to hit, I will be adding remaining wallets to sheet and then this morning at 6 a.m. he says okay just a quick update I will post an announcement today when we are good to go I don't have a set time I will say that I will told three business days as I stated in the video not sure whether it's going to come in the morning afternoon or evening but as soon as it comes, I will let everyone know. Then I will start attacking refunds. All right, so there you go. 
lots of updates but still waiting for his loan once he got it he'll start sending them out hopefully pretty soon I'll check these through the day and make sure that they're coming in or when they come in maybe I'll make another video there just so everyone knows that they're going out I found it interesting I just kinda you know when you're waiting for refunds like Manny's waiting he's asking for everyone's wallets for the remaining refunds to put in something to do you know so this is what I put in <laughs> I was just looking at the calculator here so on February 17th 460,000 463,000 was in there and uh, I just look here at a month later month and a half later pretty much two months I guess later <clears throat> So we're coming up on the 31st, and that's what I should have had in my accounts. <laughs> uh, that's at the 2% a day, of course. But anyway, it was a good thing while it lasted, but now we're just waiting for the refunds of less than half of that. So there we go. So yeah, I just kind of look at stuff like that I shouldn't though because it makes me sad right uh, Novatech had a couple of um, announcements um, but that was basically telling everyone when you request your for cash out option uh, I guess last week they kept it open that one day and so now they're saying it will remain open for 72 hours this week in order to allow everyone access so um, they extended it three days instead of just Monday uh, and apparently the the site went down for updating so it says maintenance has been completed Novatech site is back up so that's Good. Hopefully uh, they'll catch up here. March 1st is two days away, three days away. Um, and anyone who follows me or followed me into crypto program, um, please get signed up on this site here under uh, Telegram. This is put on by my upline Travis. He's really good on this telegram group to post all of Ed's announcements these two are really important so uh, get on to this uh, crypto program and if you look at my when you click on my video just go enter show more here in the description below and you'll see you know I say if you want to earn 25% a month please email me at and this is my email and for news and updates for the crypto program you know click on this and it'll bring you to his crypto thing that says join channel and just join the channel and uh, get updates so very cool uh, and he has another one on there let's see that is just for chats so you can click on these and people are bringing up a bunch of chat boxes or blogs they just talk to each other kind of cool um, so yeah keep informed by getting to this telegram group for a crypto program all right and I double checked the harvest box and it's not quite open yet um, but if you do go to the home page the video that I'm going to tack on to the end of this video is right here on the home page. It's 15 minutes long, so we should probably get to it. And this is one more sad thing, because uh, I've been looking for that refund forever. And 50000 of my refund was going to go into XRP purchase. I don't know if anyone's up to date with XRP. But these are weeks, so... If he had given it to us a couple of weeks ago, I mean, it went to 34 cents. 
And now look at that sucker. Whew. Went all the way up. What's the high there? 58 cents. But there is a nice pullback right here, so it'd be nice to get my refund so I can buy more of this. I was going to get with 30 something cents here, uh, 50,000 was going to buy about 150,000 coins. But now with it way up here, I might just get 100,000 coins. Anyway, I already have a bag of XRP. I just wanted to add to it before it explodes. Uh, the SEC is suing them and keeping them down for the last two years. But the settlement's supposed to be coming, or settlement, it, decision should be coming in by the end of March. So that's probably why it started spiking. That would have been nice to get in there. Even if I get out up here, that's, uh, boy, 34 to 58. That's like an 80% climb there. <clears throat> Anyway, that was just one other thing <laughs> that kind of irritates me about waiting for the refund without earning potential. Um, I would have loved to have gotten it on the 17th, you know, even if you didn't want it to go to astronomical proportions like this calculator shows that it goes to a, a million bucks. But if I'd have got it on the 17th with that, I would at least put it into things that were going to be earning some interest and not just sit around for two months. Anyway, all right. So I think we'll cut it off there and we'll talk to everyone tomorrow, hopefully with some good news in my MetaMask account. Does that sound familiar? Yeah, I said that last night too. <laughs> all right. This is going to be it. This is the day. Hopefully it starts from high to low. <laughs> All right. Talk to everyone tomorrow. Bye. Okay. I just want to do a quick updated video. It's going to be posted in the Discord. And it's also going to be posted on the website as well. That way everybody's getting the proper information. Now, before we get into this, I do, I do want to say that um, we had an AMA, which was held on Discord. Um, basically, you know, and the thing is a lot of people are just trying to always use what I say against me on a constant, consistent basis. So with that being said, um, I get, you know, I've gotten a lot of uh, threats uh, towards me. I've gotten a lot of harassment towards me and um, I, it's just not right. And I'm not going to be answering any of those threats or harassments anymore. Um, it's just it's just not right for me. A person that has um, constantly been giving everybody updates. Yes, there's been changes, obviously, but I did do in the AMA. I did an AMA, which was uh, basically held on. I believe the AMA was held on, um, I believe it was Monday morning, early, early Monday morning. There was a AMA held um, in, in a Discord group uh, that was based around PGV. OK, so um, if you haven't if you're not in the Discord group in our Discord group, then you may have not seen it. That's why I'm putting this also on the website. But basically in the AMA, I talked about loans. OK, so basically what I what I was doing is getting a collateralized loan. That means that I'm basically getting a loan against my own assets. OK, um, and that's basically your you you don't liquidate your assets. You put um, your you use them as collateral to get a loan. OK, uh, for those of you that don't understand what that is or what that means, um, then you need to look it up and do your research, educate yourself on that. OK, so with that being said, I was approved. OK, on Saturday. OK, on Saturday is when I was approved for that loan. All right. We held the AMA on, I believe it was uh, Monday morning, early Monday morning. The AMA was held. So Saturday I was approved for the loan. Now. Um, what I recently found out and just again, I did a, a status or I basically did a status uh, check on the loan to try to figure out, you know, what's going on. When is it going to arrive? Originally, um, I was made to believe that the loan would arrive. OK, by today, which is March 28th, that it would arrive by March 28th uh, between the time of uh, between the time of uh, 4 p.m. and 5 p.m. OK. Um, and that would be on 4, 4 or 5 p.m. On, on EST time. I'm saying EST time because a lot of you are maybe on EST time. All right. If you're looking at it from uh, AST time, then that would mean that 
that would be an hour up. Okay, so be 5 uh, p.m. to 6 p.m. AST time. So that's originally what I was um, brought to believe that it was going to be available during that time frame. Okay, um, now the recent information that I received said that, and this is what the response was, that it can take up to, to 72, okay, basically three working days, okay, before the loan actually hits. Three working days, meaning uh, business days, all right? Um, everybody is swarming me about this. And I just, like I said, I just I just took out this loan. I got approved for this loan on Saturday, all right? It hasn't even been, understand this is a loan, okay? It, it's it, it, a huge, huge loan. And I'm loaning against my assets. And it, it, it's, it's understand, I want it to be here now, just like everybody else, but this is the reality. It's up to 72 hours, okay? Uh, and that is working days. Three, 72 hours is three days. So three working days, three business days is how long it can take um, before I receive it, okay? So I have not received it yet. And that's why people are just flipping out. Everyone's going crazy right now. And the reality is that it is already approved and it is coming. But again, nobody wants to be patient and wait. Um, and I, even me, I'm, I'm, I'm personally getting really agitated and really it's just driving me crazy because again, I have all these people threatening me and all this stuff going on. So with that being said, 72, uh, if you're looking at 72 hours and I'm gonna update this on the site as well, okay? Because this is just recent information that I got and I'm gonna update this on the site as well. So if you're looking at from Saturday, okay? That would mean uh, you would not count Sunday because Sunday is not a business day, working business day. You would count Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. This means that I should be receiving it if it's in a 72-hour, three working business day time frame. I should be receiving it by no later than tomorrow, okay? And that's just the reality. I, there's nothing I can do. Listen, I cannot control when it's available everybody's attacking me saying this oh this you're lying this this and that it's, it's a constant thing and, and i'm just to the point where i'm just i'm not dealing with it anymore i'm sitting here trying to get the remaining refunds done um this has been talked about so many times we have sent out thousands of refunds thousands of refunds and we have about i believe uh with the people that filled out the form because we had a lot of people that went and filled out the refund. And I'm just gonna go here real quick. Uh, if you click on remaining wallets to refund, okay. <clears throat> if you click here, um, we created a document and this document has a list of the wallets that are left. Now there's some missing obviously because people are constantly filling out the refund form. We don't understand why people didn't fill this out earlier. This was meant to be filled out a long time ago, but yet some people never filled it out for whatever reason. So. We had a lot of uh, wallets that were added to the list, okay? So it was probably about 1,500 total wallets left to refund, okay? And as soon as this loan is available, okay, everybody is going to get refunded, all right? I cannot control when exactly it hits. And I, I'm, I'm really just, again, I'm tired of dealing with the threats. I'm tired of dealing with the harassment, and I'm not going to anymore. You know, people are talking about reporting me for this and that. Listen, I everybody is getting refunded okay uh, i'm i haven't done nothing wrong to anybody other than the fact that people have have been waiting a while for their refund but everybody is getting it okay everybody that put in is coming out with more than what they put in all right so again going back to what i stated they are coming i'm waiting on that to come through as soon as it does from that point in time i will be going ahead and sending them out and i'm going to update this on here as well all right now people want me to sit here and share proof of the loan i'm not going to sit here and share proof of the loan because what's going to happen is just like everybody's been using everything against me it's going to be where they're going to try to find out where i got the loan from exactly where you know where i got the loan from okay they're going to use the screenshots they're going to use what i provide to try to find out where i got the loan so then they can go ahead and try to report me and then it's just going to make things worse so again i'm not putting i'm not going to be doing that okay i'm not doing that at all and i'm sorry but that's not what i'm going to be doing so this is the, what's going on i just wanted to put this information out there because there's so much fud around this and people are just saying that it's a rug and that this and that and that's just not the case um, I've already explained what I was doing. I had an AMA on this. Yes, uh, I, I was meant. I was brought to believe that the loan would be available, 
at this specific time, this specific day. But again, as I was recently informed, it could take up to 72 working days, business days. All right. And that's just, there's nothing that I can do about that. That is out of my control 100%. Okay. So um, that's what I have for everybody. Um, so pertaining to the re remaining refunds, when it comes to that, um, the remaining refunds, again, as soon as that hits, we will be going ahead and we will be, again, sending out those refunds. Okay. And that's all we can do. That is all we can do. Um, now, coming over here, pertaining to the BSC USD, USDC, again, I'm going to update the site so everybody can see this information. All right. Here, um, pertaining USDC contract, we want everybody to go ahead and refund. Every, we want everybody to, when we, and this is not right now, but when we have the funds, again, waiting on the loan, uh, once that comes through and we have that, what's going to happen is um, everybody is going to go ahead and they will start to refund themselves because this contract, you can refund yourself. Okay. And everybody on the contract that was on the contract, once we cut this function on um, and we have to basically pump funds into the contract first, we got to pump funds into this contract here. Okay. It has to get pumped in right here. we got to pump the funds into the contract. And then from that point, once we pump the funds in, um, we'll go ahead and turn on this here. We'll turn on the refund thing with well, the, uh, the refund function and everybody can start refunding themselves. Okay. We will be changing this because this is wrong. Okay. Uh, I just want to get the proper, proper information out there. We're going to actually be pumping up the contract. Once the loan's available, we'll pump up the contract first and then start doing refunds at the same time. That way people aren't waiting um, to, to get their self refund from this contract while we're doing the other ones. Okay. So I'm going to fix these updates on the site and, and, and put the correct information here because we're not going to go ahead and have people waiting until all the refunds are done before we actually go ahead and start um, doing out, <clears throat> excuse me, doing out the, um, uh, I'm, we're not going to make people wait. Okay. Until you make the users wait until we have finished out the uh, remaining refunds from the other contracts before we allow this one to go ahead and, and do the same thing. We want to allow it to be done, <clears throat> excuse me, at a, <clears throat> at around the same time. What, so we'll pump this contract up while we send out refunds from the other one. That way they can both be kind of getting out the way at the same time. And that's the process of what we're doing, everyone. Okay. Um, again, um, just, just the harassment has been absolutely ridiculous and I, I'm over it. Okay. There's nothing anybody can do, including me, no matter what threats or things you say to me, it's not going to change the fact that I'm waiting on a loan right now. Um, on my own, again, use, I use my, my own assets as collateral and I'm waiting on that loan. Okay. Um, again, I was informed 72 hours, um, max would be 72 hours max, which is three working days, three business days with a max it would take for the loan to hit. I'm waiting on that now. So it will be when it hits, I'm going to start sending them out. That is my, that is exactly what I'm going to do. So again, um, you know, we ask everybody to stop with the threats. It's not going to do anything to help with this. Okay. Um, I'm doing everything I possibly can to get this done as quickly as I possibly can. Again, um, with what we have left, again, we dished out well over 7,000 uh, refunds in total, well over 7,000 users received their refund, and we're doing out the remaining, and then everybody can go ahead and move on from this project, okay? And uh, that's that's where we're at with everything, all right? That's where we're at with it, and there's really nothing more to say about it because, again, that's uh, there, that's anything else is out of my control. I'm just simply letting you know what's happening and um, how we're going to go ahead and get this done and, and, and the time it's going to take. Now, once the loan hits from that point, um, from that point, I'm going to start sending out the refunds. So as the refunds go out, other than the USDC contract, because again, you can self-refund yourself from that contract, but this contract, the, the BSC, USDT, the Polygon and the Tron contracts, those are, we sent, we send out the refunds. Okay. So the refund time it's going to take to get, get them done is going to be 48 to 72 hours to get them done once the once the uh once we have access to the funds and the loan lands and we have access to the funds from there we're going to go ahead and um start sending them out and this is the time it's going to take now if you're in the discord group we are going to post and i'm going to be posting that right after i post this video in discord we're going to be posting the um 
we will be posting the the links okay to the wallets that we're going to be using to do the refunds so there's going to be wallet addresses you guys will be able to track and see from each um there's going to be a us usdt a bsc usdt wallet that's going to be have the refund set from there we're going to provide that wallet in the discord group um the uh the um uh, the Polygon die uh, refund, that wallet's going to be posted as well. So you know where the refunds are going to be coming from. And then also the TRX, which is the TRX USDT contract, USDT wallet. We're going to post those three wallets so you know where the refunds are coming from. Because of each one of those contracts that we're refunding from are on different networks. So everybody's getting a refund in, in a different, uh, you know, different network. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to post those. I'm going to actually post those right now. And uh, that's all we can do. Okay. Um, again, I'm not going to be answering anymore. I'm not going to be having any AMAs. I'm not going to be doing that because it's just constant people trying to use things against me. Anything I say gets used against me. And it's just a constant, constant thing. And I just want to, um, you know, I'm just not going to spend the next time, you know, spend whatever time I have remaining before this, this loan hits to um constantly do amas and it's just it's just i'm not doing it it's not doing it people just keep using what i say against me and it's uh it's completely ridiculous so with that being said again um the threats the and the uh the harassment's just not dealing with it anymore um everybody is free to do as they please obviously but again i'm giving you the information and providing it to you here so with that being said um, that's the update I have for everyone. Again, the wallets will be posted in Discord group uh, if you're watching this. And uh, from that, again, as soon as the loan hits, I will post an update. I will post it in the uh, in the Discord group saying, hey, it was received and refunds are going to start being sent out. Once the loan's received from that point, all we're doing from there is we then have to send, uh, send out the funds uh, into, we actually all have to send it out into the wallets that we're using to go ahead and do refunds. And from there, we'll start sending them out. So that's going to be the process once it's received. Okay. That's the update I have for everybody. And uh, I will go ahead and see everybody um, in the next video, which I'll do. A, it's going to be a quick two-minute video. Once the loan's available, letting everybody know it's available and refunds are going to get start getting sent out.